So today we're going to make a video on a product that I've been using, I've been testing out, so I can make this video for you guys, and that is, um, I guess you pronounce it Melafix, um, by API, and if you don't know exactly what it is, it, it's, it's a type, it's a, it's a medication for fish, and what it, what it plans to treat is bacteria, bacteria, um, infections on fish, and that can be anywhere from open wounds, um, damaged fins, anything that's kind of the, kind of, I guess you could say the outside of the fish, not really internally. I think this can help that too, and that's kind of what my purpose was for this, but basically, basically any, any problems with the fish, um, externally is what this really, um, plans, plans to do with your fish, and, um, this bottle, this is a pretty big bottle. Um, you'll probably need a big bottle um, unless you have a nail tank or something because you will use a lot of this stuff because you'll have to dose it daily um, if you are going to do this. And just like on the box, it rapidly repairs damaged fins and open wounds um, and then promotes regrowth of damage. Or, so it just repairs fins like we discussed and then all natural, some tea, okay. So the, so the back, it kind of just shows you a couple so fin rot that's pretty common um we got red sores which i don't see very often in aquarium fish and then open body wounds that's pretty common and then popeye out body slime body fungus that's pretty that's, that's probably the most common one out of all these and fin rot but you know i, I got this because I, I eventually figured out that I bought some fish and from the pet store now they're all gone because it one of the fish or at least a lot of the fish carried a disease from the fish store and I, I usually quarantine my fish and of course the time that I don't it ends up happening and it wiped out probably half of the half of the 40s tank um luckily not any of the you know the main fish in the tank just a lot of the scum a lot of the tetras which sucks but it's just another thing um you know that I learned and now I can tell you guys so you're not really making the same mistake as I did but um they were kind of getting I didn't know what was wrong with them the fish were just randomly dying and I couldn't see no problem with them it's not, they didn't have nothing like um they didn't have ick or nothing I couldn't see any signs of anything externally happening so I was thinking it was um like a bacteria I mean something internally in the fish that was making them I mean, clearly there was a disease coming around because there's no fish that were attacking them. They were in perfectly fine condition. They were just dying off. So I, I basically, you know, kind of being a detective and kind of finding, the, looking what's, you know, pointing out what the, what's happening to these fish. And I basically narrowed it down to, um, obviously there was a disease and I can basically confirm it now because now there's ick and the 40 and i have um ick x that i will eventually review for that too um coming and this actually wasn't a buy bad buy either because this actually fits um uh, fix some of the problems with the other fish um because this will fix internal problems so um um so it just it's not a bad idea to have it on hand anyway even if you don't have the problem now does it work what I've seen, yes. I of course I haven't had a lot, a lot of time to really say. I mean, it works hundred percent of the time. But what for my purpose and what I was using it for, yes, it it hundred percent works. It's definitely a great product. Um, and I I know a lot of people with fish definitely there's a big problem of damaged fins, and um, just the outside body, like it said on the back, I think was um, Popeye. That's I see that a lot in. Um, and beginner beginners, you know, carrying fish, and really in general, a lot of people have fish um, like that that have weird external problems. And this will definitely fix it. Um, a lot of the major stuff like Popeye will probably take a little longer, but definitely like um, the open wounds and the the fin rod. Definitely, this stuff can be, um, fix your fish right up really fast. And it's really nice to have. And of course, I didn't have no meds on me. I don't. I've never had any problems with diseases or anything with fish ever in my life and I've d done this for well over close to 10 years now and 
you know, of course, I don't have meds on me, so it kind of sucks that I didn't have on me, and now I have to wait and fish. I've already, already gone now, so it's kind of my responsibility now to keep meds on me at all times. And for stuff like ick, some some of the stuff that's more common than the others, but um, but I definitely would recommend this product. I mean, there's nothing much more to say. I mean. Some people might um, wonder, does this like stain? Because a lot of meds sometimes they're blue and they'll stain like plastic plants. Um, of course, this tank doesn't have to worry about that. But um, no, it doesn't stain anything. It's actually um, it's just a clear color. It, it, it looks like a bottle of like a prime or something. That's really what it looks like. It com it comes in clear. Maybe it has a little haze to it, but it goes in clear. Um, make sure you obviously don't have carbon. This will just suck it right up and then it's useless. But the way, but the way to do this is, obviously, when you get your first day, dose it. Um, there are instructions on the back of how much you know per gallons to dose, and put in one, put in however much you need the first day. And you're gonna want to do that every day. And I forget how much they want. Yeah, they say to do it for a week, um, seven days. So. And then and then and then they really recommend after seven days to do a water change, which is a good idea because dosing this every day for a week definitely it messes up your water kind of good, you know, the clear the um, the water quality, not the actual parameters, but the you know the cleanness of your tank, so it won't look as clear um, during the week when you're dosing this. So after that seven days, when you do a water change, your tank will look good again, and. After doing what you don't really need to put if you do have carbon you can put it back in but you, um, you really don't if you're trying to get rid of this you don't need it you don't really need to put carbon to get rid of it after water changes it'll eventually go away in your tank after a couple water changes so not, there's not a big deal about that but yeah that's just a quick rundown I don't want to make this any longer than it has to be but if you're gonna get this I definitely go with the eight ounce bottle you know a little bit bigger just so you have it on hand it's always good to have a big bottle of meds out of all times and that's basically what this video is about is always keep stuff like this um have have meds for external problems and internal problems have you know so you can defeat any problem that's in your fish but other than that i'll make a review on x I I x when the time comes but other than that call my subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one